U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken in Israel on Wednesday. It was the last leg of his seventh trip to the region since the war between Israel and Hamas erupted last October. As ceasefire talks between the warring parties appear to be stalling, Blinken said the ball is now in the Palestinian militant group's court. I um, met earlier today with uh, Prime Minister Netanyahu and uh, we talked about, of course, the uh, hostage deal that's, uh, that's on the table uh, that would uh, produce an immediate ceasefire, get the hostages home, uh, alleviate the suffering of uh, Palestinian people in Gaza, uh, and also give us something uh, to build on for the future, to get to durable peace and security. Um, Israel has made very important uh, compromises in the proposal that, that, that's on the table, uh, demonstrating its um, desire and willingness to get this agreement and get it done. Uh, now, as we've been saying, it's on Hamas. Uh, Hamas has to decide uh, whether it will take this deal um, and actually advance uh, the uh, situation for the people that it purports to care about uh, in Gaza. Uh, there is no time for delay. Uh, there's no time for uh, further uh, haggling. Uh, the deal is there. They should take it. Israel says a planned military operation in the city of Rafah will go ahead despite U.S. opposition and a United Nations warning that it would lead to tragedy.